snap my fingers, everybody would fall asleep. Let's go back to the crime scene. Back to when you all first came across the murder scene of advice columnist Rita Reclaw. Witness number one, what do you remember? I saw a man shooting a woman. He put her body in a cart or a wagon and he started pulling her away. Are you sure? Witness number two. I remember seeing a man with a gun. Are you sure you don't remember it like this? No, something is all right. That's how I remember it. No, he's right. That's not how I remember it. Witness number three. Let's see if we can get you to remember what you saw. There was a man and woman arguing. It's kind of fuzzy. He had gray hair. I think he was in his 50s. He had a gun. That's pretty detailed. Are you sure? Rita, you give advice. I'm a psychiatrist. We can fix this. What the hell? That's not how I remember it! You're right, there. There was something else. That's more like it. You don't remember a man with a gun shooting a woman, placing her body in a cart. She's right. That's exactly what we saw. You're imagining things. What, like her number in your phone or her pictures in your text? What are you doing going through my phone? I do this for a living. I know how this works. No, Rita. This is how this works. Oh God, we gotta get out of here. We gotta call the police. Wait, we're still hypnotized. We're still sitting in his house. He's not trying to get us to remember the crime. He's erasing our memory of the crime itself. Somebody has to take out the garbage. We have to wake up, but we're hypnotized. He's in control. Wake us up, you bastard! When I snap my fingers, you'll wake up. You'll remember nothing about the crime scene. What do you remember? The last thing I remember is my car breaking down. Where in the hell are we and who in the hell are you? I remember shopping. <clears throat> I'm afraid this session produced no results. Thank you all for coming.
You saw him kill me. Don't forget. <laughs>